Cabo fans, hope you are all doing fantastic. So Cabo Cafe, including, um, has decided <laughs> to do a coffee shop road trip today. We're going to vlog uh, the whole of Zambezi. We're going to start right on the end, uh, Pretoria North. We're going to come all the way through and end on the Cullinan Road. We're going to try and show you guys all the different coffee shops. So join us on this little trip. Okay, so the very first pit stop would be Coffee to You. They are located here on Lavender Road. So if you drive on Lavender, there's a Sassel garage. And they're located right here. They're a roastery. And uh, let's see what they got. So Coffee to You is mainly a little roastery that roasts specifically for corporate companies and a few small coffee shops. Wonderful little place. They have also agreed to do a interview soon and then we'll be hearing where they come from, why they chose coffee and where they want to go in the future. So keep your eyes on this channel to see their interview soon. Okay, so next on the list is Rory's and Mug and Bean. An interesting thing about Mug and Bean, it's not really a coffee shop anymore, guys. Mug and Bean now is a restaurant that sells coffee. So I'll show you the difference between a coffee shop and Mug and Bean. How are you? Good and you? I'm good, sir. What's your name? Welcome. My name is BB. BB? <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> So right now we are in Mug and Bean. Um, we're going to grab a little something to, to taste here. And then we'll move over to Aubrey's. So, love the new menus, Mug and Bean. Love the new menus. So guys, this is the difference between a coffee shop and a mug and bean. You guys saw the mug and bean now, now this is a coffee shop. So next up is the steam room by Kolikis Café next to Perfect Water next to Woolworths. What coffee do you guys do? Nicola. Nicola. Yo, what's good? Come on, man! We're back with another video. <laughs> We're back with another video. So next on the list is a new coffee shop in the area. So, Cabo fans, if you've not been juice <laughs> yet, do yourself a favor, go pop in, say hi, tell them that we told you guys to go there, go and taste their coffee. Remember what we always say, you have to taste all coffees to know what you like and what you dislike. Because all coffee shops' coffees are different. So uh, let's go and check Bean Juice out. I and like it. And if we do not go to Bean Juice, the bean is not going to be very juicy. <laughs> I'm Elson. 
always perfect. <laughs> I'm his boss. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like that. <laughs> I'm going to make your medium blend. But wait, tell them you, where you started and where you involved in. Nah, coffee has been years. Eh? Well, I've been to Bogotelo, I've been to Tribeca, I've been to Woolworths, so now I'm at Bean Juice. Now so you're Bean now, now I'm home, eh? <laughs> <laughs> and you were, you were second in the region? Yeah. Now you're working for a proper coffee shop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not for a Woolworths. <laughs> Now I'm working for him now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we try. But uh, no, you guys know what they do. Alright, so this is our medium blend. I'm going to make you one of the best. And the, uh, the bean else? Well, it's our classic blend, eh? Classic blend? Medium roast, classic blend. What's yes. inside though? Well, we Origins. have a, a bit of Nicaragua, mm, a nice bit of Brasilia, a nice bit of Ethiopia. And a little secret. And a little secret? Yeah. <laughs> I like that. I like that very much. Otherwise everyone's going to have a classic blend. Otherwise everyone will have a classic blend. <laughs> As you can right see. There. Nice crema. Nice crema. That's nice our one. medium tiger tiger stripes. I like that. Oh, there we see? go. That's fine. I can't even see it. It even smells nice. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. So let's taste it. <laughs> How's the smell? I'll video you. That's how you eat. Oh, there you go. Face says everything. About a 7 acidity. Oh, wow. Nice and earthy. More a red soil. Red ground. Very beautiful. Is that the secret in there, Alice? <laughs> yeah, it's almost. <laughs> I, can, I can pick up on the Brazil, the, the nuttiness, the earthiness. Yeah. Tobacco, there's actually some sure. sweet tobacco there as well in the middle of the time. Finishes. That's amazing. What would you rate our bean out of 10? No pressure. No, out of 10, that's a, a good. Oh, it's an 8.5 oh, to yeah. 9 B. Yeah, that's a good espresso. Yeah, half hour, <laughs> That's definitely a good espresso. <laughs> yes, I want to go. want to go to 9. <laughs> they, there's a flavor of Tanzania in there okay. that I can pick up, but that could just be the fruitiness of the Ethiopian. Yeah. Awesome. But there's also. Could it be in there? Come on. I'm thinking you're... upon that spicy. Nah, bro, you you're not for him. <laughs> serious? Stop exposing it, our secret. Yeah. I won't, I won't post the name. Yeah, I'll, I'll just say what's right. <laughs> but luckily, it didn't give the ratios away. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is it? I have no idea. He knows. <laughs> Yeah, I was roasting this one, so yeah. it's yeah. a secret. I'm, I'm glad you, nobody will know. I'll bleep it out for the video. But I, I love the body. Just awesome. that spiciness it leaves in the throat. Yeah. It's Alright, show us what you can do. Like no it. pressure again. <laughs> So simplistic, so nice and clean, and the owner is phenomenal. I love it. Guys, please go and turn there, say hi to them, go and taste their coffees. They've got Carl's Coffee there. Carl's Coffee has been roasting for many, 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 many years. And for those couple of fans that we, that we saw there, that we met there, so glad you guys are going out and experiencing the other coffees. It's great. Teach your palate how to taste coffee. 
Now we're quickly going out to Red Truck. We're just gonna go and say hi. If you guys haven't seen uh, the vlog or the interview with Red Truck, go and check it out. I think it's episode something in the 30s, 35 or 36 on the YouTube channel. Um, go and check them out. Their coffee is also phenomenal. But let's go and pop in, say hi. For those of you that don't know where Red Truck is, you go to Green Olive, you walk around Green Olive, and you find this little space. Just check this out. This is so adorable. I love this. It's so antique-ish. These old tractors, this little shack, you know. It's just so gorgeous. Love it. Guys, please come check this out. There's the famous red truck. Can you hear your salvation coming? Hovering above your head in the sky. So that brings us to a half a end. The thing I love about the coffee culture, about the coffee community, about coffee shops in general, is these guys love sitting and talking for hours which is awesome guys that's what makes the coffee culture so unique so if i didn't get to you guys like there is two or three shops that we didn't get to because time just ran out what's this fly doing on my nose um i will get to you guys i promise but for today this is the end of the vlog hope you guys enjoyed this give us a thumbs up if you'll be nice enough smash the down button if you're into that subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet please guys we try and post as much as possible uh, but most of all thank you guys for watching we love you see you on the next vlog